You guys now advance to eight and one on the season, the best record in Major League Baseball in a short 60 game season. What does it mean to get out to that type of a jump? Um, look, obviously excited with the start and with the record and, you know, the fact that I feel like we're, we're playing good baseball. Um, but even though it is a shorter season, it's it's a long ways to go. Right. So um, happy with where we are. Uh, we need to keep grinding now. We got a, a, a day off tomorrow ahead of a tough stretch of essentially a tough road trip with a couple double headers and a lot in a row. So we got to, uh, you know, continue to play well and, and and try and keep racking them up. Gio with a grand slam the other night, three run shot tonight, not to mention defensively made some unbelievable grabs. What do you think of his all around game to start the season? Yeah, he's become just, I mean, he's, been such an important player for us and he's been so steady you know a true two-way player now and um you know he's he's big at bats and big spots um I, I feel like he's just he's been really having a good plan going into the game and going in there and executing and um just really glad he's on our side you don't see brett gardner go opposite field often what are you thinking in the dugout when you see that you know he hit it and i went I think that's gone. I, like, that was my first thought. It was similar. He hit the ball in Baltimore last year where he really, I was like, right away, it felt like a homer to me. Um, so, and and sure enough, it, he rode it out of here. So, um, obviously, the guys had a lot of fun with that. And uh, Garrett Cole, what was your impression tonight? Uh, good. Um, you know, I thought, I thought the Phillies, you know, really hunted the fastball on them. Um, had a pretty good plan. I thought Bruce put together a really good at bat on him, you know, going from 0-2 and laying off some some chase pitches to get back to a heater. Um, so they were pretty aggressive with his fastball, which I thought was really good on the night. And, you know, we're able to, you know, put together some decent at bats. But then you look up and it's, you know, 90-ish pitches, just the home run and, and one run. So just another really strong outing by our ace. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Ken Davidoff, you have the next question. Aaron, uh, as you said, Garrett is undefeated so far as pitched very well, but you've, you've seen him at his absolute peak uh, these last couple of years. You know, how, I guess how, how much higher is his ceiling than how already very good he's been for? Well, it? yeah, I mean, he's going to have those games. You know, he's got that kind of stuff where, you know, it can be a shutout. It's, you know, he's going to hold teams down when he gets in those roles on a given night where it's just going to, he's going to cut through no matter what the lineup is. Um, so, you know, that's always possible. But I think what he's showing you right now is just how good a pitcher he is, um, you know, kind of still finding his way a little bit. But I'm excited about where he's at. You know, the curveball really factored in tonight, especially as the outing went along. He was pitch efficient. Um, you know, I think, you know, considering where we are in the calendar and everything, I think he's in a great spot. And what do you see going on with Gary Sanchez? Um, <clears throat> I felt like, you know, going again, I go back to the last at bat in Baltimore that I thought was good. And then he had a uh, game where I th you know, a couple of the games in, in the Boston series where I thought he was better. Um, you know, tonight, you know, maybe a couple pitches off the plate that got him behind in the count. And then, you know, just a little bit racing out there, you know, kind of chasing that hit a little bit. So he's just got to continue to trust that he can control the zone and, um, you know, really stay in his legs. And when he does that, he'll take off. Thank you, Ron. Yep. Henri, you have the next question. Go ahead and unmute. Hi, Aaron. Uh, with the cancellation tomorrow, uh, how is the starting rotation going to be yeah. in Philly? Yeah, so Hap will definitely start one of the games Wednesday, and then we'll we'll talk through, um, you know, how we're going to line it up from there. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Max Goodman, go ahead and unmute. Hey, Aaron. Uh, I feel like we ask you this every single night at this point, but Another great performance out of the bullpen, especially with Chad getting the two strikeouts, and then Britton's been filling in for Chapman really well. Uh, what are your thoughts on on those two guys? Yeah, I mean, you know, big big outs by Greeny, obviously, to stop it there. Um, you know, when they were threatening to really get back in the game, um, so to come in and thwart it with just a great effort. You know, Greeny's been feel like 
the command and, and feel of the fastball is usually always there, but it's definitely there. And his curveball has become much more of a factor for him. And then Britt's, Britt's just, you know, throwing the ball really well. Um, you know, stuff looks, you know, as good as we've seen it at any time here. Um, the slider's playing a factor for him. Um, you know, he's been pretty pitch efficient coming in and being economical with it. So, you know, obviously those, those two guys are, are huge for us at the back end.